Can I unmute everything? Ah, here we are. Morning. Good afternoon. How's it going? Happy this Saturday. Yeah, happy Saturday. How's it going? Ah! Mini, I appreciate you. We, uh... I got, a, I got a whole bunch of stuff running that I'm going to have to close before starting the game, because I have found out that, um, uh, the game actually does not like very much having things in the background. Um, no you. But how's it going? I know we had a pretty late night last night, so... Hope you all got enough rest. Um, I'm not expecting an early turn up for this. And I don't really have a big spiel at the beginning of this. Um, but I wanted to put the model up so I could say hi to people. Scorpy! Hello! How's it going? Welcome in. Mm -mm -mm. But yeah, we had a fun night last night with, um, you woke up early with way too much energy. Oh my god. Mini. What did you do? You screwed the way this works. I, I wish I could wake up with energy. Like, I miss the days where I could wake up with energy. Some chores and other stuff. Like, during the week, I would definitely appreciate waking up with energy. Like, I would love to. I'm gonna... I mean, I don't know if you follow Scorpy. But I'm gonna shout them out anyways. Um, because Scorpio's adorable and uh, deserves all of the love that we can give. Why? Because I feel like it. It's my channel. I can do what I want. Deal with it. Well, yeah. It's a Saturday, and I, I, I feel like, I feel like, uh, there's not enough positivity and support in the world. But anybody who's lurking, you jacked you. You checked your beard. <laughs> nice. You checked your... Wait, you, oh, you're in VR chat right now? Yee? Are you watching in VR chat or are you watching on the side? Because I've been told by multiple people on the side. Ah. I've been told to, to like, look into VR chat. And I'm like, I don't have a headset. And they're like, you don't need one. And I'm like, hmm. That requires effort. And uh, time. You don't have a headset? Doesn't it like like, like kind of limit you how much stuff you can do in it? Oh, I have no doubt that my PC could run it. I would be surprised if my PC couldn't run it. But use IMVU so this Ah. Why be bonk? Why might be bonk? Um, when I go to switch over to the game, just to give you guys a heads up, the model is going to have to go away. So is the music, because um, if I limit my if my CPU is peaking at a hundred percent, the game is going to slow down. Welcome in, Vix.
But as a reminder for people who are watching the VOD and for those of you who are here, um, there is, uh, I don't know why it says five days ago. Uh, I have the stuff off. I have the stuff off just so I don't have to um, toggle it at like in about like 30 seconds when I go to switch. Um, but as a reminder, there is a deal that I have with with y'all. Where if by the end of stream on July 1st, y'all get that number in the bottom right corner from 154 to 250, I will schedule both a League of Legends stream and a Pokemon Smash or Strap Smash bleh, 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 Pokemon Smash or Pass. Um, those are not the same stream. Those will be two different streams. <laughs> Wait, does Vix have 15,000 points? Do you want to shoot the, shoot the cowboy? I mean, you could just DM him on Discord and get his ass in here. Just tell him we're doing VR chat and he'll, he'll be like, hmm. I gotta go snoop this out, and then he'll cut in here and be like, I'm sorely disappointed. Um. The goggles are here for stealing. It needs to happen naturally. Yeah, that's fair. Alright, I'm gonna start setting up for this. Mostly because uh, I have to start closing things. All right, let's close that. I'm gonna close this. Uh, need to close this. Uh, I believe that's all I need to close in the background. Okay. So, are y'all ready for the nostalgia sounds? Oh, why are you... Okay, I swear to God. There we are. And now I just need to adjust my audio sources. Why are people in your face shouting your name? Tell them to fuck off. Tell them you're watching Bird. But yes, have fun. Enjoy VR chat. Um, I think it's now in the game. Okay, cool. Yes, yes. Just need to make sure it's running at 100%. Because, um, if, if my PC, if my, my CPU gets, uh, bogged down, it will run slower than 100%, which is just awkward. I was just a child when the stars fell from the skies. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the lark. And in turn, how that cannon brought war upon us. Oh God. War was an abstract idea, nothing more than a show on TV. As a child, I only saw it as something that happened in some. The a, the anime, the anime signs. Hi, Minnie Mouse. Welcome in. That final day of summer. One day, while on my way to school, I looked up in the skies. A sound like distant thunder. <laughs> it's not Minnie Mai, it's just Minnie Mo's. In the blue skies far above me. Vix. drew dizzying circles around in a crazy waltz. A battle in the beautiful skies far away. I could not tear my gaze away from them. Auto cucumber on the phone. The fighters play the cat or the mouse in turn as they climb swiftly into the Vix. 
Well, it's not your there's no cucumber on the phone. Spiraling and spewing orange flames to crash by the same cape where my wait is that kid's head backwards like completely backwards is he an owl now they only live in my memories of days past the victor circled around to confirm the kill i hope they go back to the kid's picture there was a large number 13 because i need to confirm whether his head was backwards or not i will never forget this hi mojo welcome in I think I got this working at 100% speed. I did test it a little bit, at least the first mission. So we're gonna hope that it doesn't slow its ass down when I, uh, as I, as I continue to play. But yeah, that, that is a, that is a problem with this game. Since I cannot use hardware encoding on this, otherwise it removes the, uh, your first and favorite Ace Combat. It, it does remove the textures if I switch over to hardware encoding. Ulysses 1994 XF04 Asteroids. Stonehenge, the erosion weapon of mass destruction. Was Wait, did you say four years after 1994? Is this 1998? Is that when this takes place? Would I be mad if. Why would I be mad? We are trying to save up for stuff, but otherwise. Strategic positions on the mainland were lost. This in turn forced ice But yeah, welcome in Mojo. East Coast to North Point. It is kind of a, it is kind of amusing playing back through these and realizing like what year they take place. Uh, the Erusians control most parts of the mainland, and they have forward deployed bombers to Wrigley Air Base, a former ISAF facility. This bomber oh. force will attempt to deal a lethal blow to the ISAF. At North Wait. Point from this so this one is the Erusians are the bad guys? Hold on. What a current sit rep and your orders for deployment effective immediately. Enemy agents destroyed our early warning radar network, allowing several air bombers to penetrate our airspace. Right. In 15 minutes, we expect this bomber formation to strike Allen Ford Air Base and then move on to targets at North Point. Our air defense forces are extremely weak at this point in time. Hence, our what GHQ country are we working with? It is mission critical that you destroy the bombers and neutralize the threat before they get past Newfield Island. Remember, you are the first line of defense for North Point. I mean, I wouldn't be mad. It's just we are actively saving for things. Wait, I can buy things. I could buy an F5. I don't have enough money, but I could, I could buy an F5. Okay. What a... Oh, I don't own the other option. Oh. Um... It, this is going to be slightly low. Oh, I guess it's not too too bad with the smaller image in the in the stream. But uh, it is going to be low res. It's not something I can fix. It's going to be the original resolution. Mobius one. You are now under my command. Six bombers on We're now under my command. Continue north to intercept. Today's my birthday. Victory sure would be nice. Today is my birthday. I did this is the mission that I tested the um, the speed out on. Happy Barb Day. It's not actually my birthday though. It's that I was just copying what the dude was saying. Three targets remaining. 
where are the escort fighters? Uh, behind you. Oh, there's no high G turns in this. Target is bombing the city. Make sure to thank him. That's a roundup. Let's go on home. Oh, I like you gotta love the you're gonna love the low quality microphones and the voice acting. Thanks to your efforts, the enemy bomber strike was averted. However, our victory will be meaningless should you fail the next mission. Our victory shall be meaningless should you fail the next mission. So what's the story with this one? to unfold in the blink of an eye. I don't remember exactly when the forces from the west occupied my town. I was too busy scanning the skies day Hi, by day, waiting for Yellow 13 to reappear. Welcome in. Look at the kitty. Before I knew it, everything changed. Everything changed when the Fire Nation attacked. taught us at school. Our friendly local sheriff disappeared and was replaced by foreign MPs. In the beginning, some people secretly tuned into broadcasts from North Point on their parabolic antennas. Satellites. But as time passed, the broadcast no longer came in. Maybe the satellites were destroyed. Parabolic antennas. Just satellite dish. Computer networks were shut that, down. That's all that is. Gasoline was rationed to civilians. That's how war works. Though we lived in the 21st century, we were reduced to using crystal radios and horse-drawn carts. Yeah. I moved in with my uncle in town, who used to be a taxi driver. Out of gasoline and out of work, my uncle did nothing but to drown himself in drink. Yeah, that happens. I earned my keep by playing the harmonica in the town bar. The one thing I was good at. I'd play for sullen occupation soldiers in exchange for their charity and loose change. And used the money to support my uncle and myself. My uncle trash-talked the barkeep who catered to the enemy soldiers. But he never refused the money yeah. he brought home. Of course you can. You're a local kid being, uh... Himself. Being occupied. You're basically a bard. Only daughter. Welcome to D and D. A little older than me. Another day passed. Yet still no sign of the fighter plane Yellow Thirteen in the skies above our town. That kid's got a rough. Like, that, that shit, that, like, just the fucking war breaks out in your town, just, and you become occupied? Oh yeah, I did see it. I'll, uh, did you post it on the Discord? The enemy held Wrigley Air Base is located in close proximity to our front lines, making it the preferred- Dude, The other kid's head was completely backwards, oh my lord. Our contention was deployed to Wrigley. Their intentions are clear. A full-scale strike on our forces at North Point is imminent. Your mission is to catch these bombers on the ground and destroy them. We okay, but so their erosions in other games were working alongside the erosions. So what country are we are we part of? Can I buy other planes? Do I have enough money? No, I do not have enough money. Thirty miles to Wrigley Air Base. Use the power lines to navigate. 
Use the power lines to navigate north, or you know, your compass. Oh, that's autopilot. Keep an eye on those interceptors. Oh, okay, there's the there's the map. Fly along the power lines. Um. No joy. I don't see anything. Obvious one passing over substation. Enemy facility destroyed. Bogey's closing in on Wrigley AB. Scramble at once. I mean. Like of the storyline in general, uh, it's still really, really. I mean, it's it's Ace Combat Four, and each of them, each of them have their own stories. Why do I want to engage? For this game? Oh, it's towards the beginning. Why do you say pickle? Like, I just started, Mini. Hard enemy radar spike. What do you mean by that? What does that mean? Radio failure. Mobius one, standing behind you. Hard enemy radar spike. Box two, box two. Mobius one destroyed the target. Okay. This is Wrigley. Our bombers are decimated. Repeat. I think by a hard enemy, I think a hard, hard uh, radar spike, I think that's the missile tracking. Mission complete. We're coming home. Oh, okay. That, that makes sense. I, in every other game, they just say that missile launched. They don't say a hard enemy radar spike. Was a success. One night, a spirited group made their way up the door, chased out the sullen army grunts, and commandeered the place. Even I knew who they were. The patch on their sleeve was the mark of the proud Air Force. A loud-mouthed, middle-aged man went around, announcing each pilot's results for the day and his running kill record. For those yeah. who five kills, a thorough toasting and soaking followed. I believe it was their custom to call a pilot an ace once he shot down five planes. After completing the day's review, the same guy... The squadron agent went on to announce. And now, for our leader's results. Everyone turned around to look at the quiet man who sat alone, strumming a guitar. I found myself drawn to the music from his guitar. Our yellow 13 bagged three more today, bringing his new tally up to 64 kills. Oh geez, that's the guy that he's been looking for. With yellow 13. Smile, the man with the guitar turned to me and asked me to accompany him on my harmonica. I brought it up to my lips and I started a new song. Okay. I had finally found him. Is this gonna be like a long-term story? But by some fluke, it was my father's favorite song. The one he used to play at the end of each day.
Okay. Playing harmonica, harmonica with the guy that you saw shooting people down above your house. That's kind of creepy. I don't know if you resent him or not. The Allied forces are retreating, and survivors are gathering at the northern port of St. Ark. However, the radar facilities atop Mount Shesna provide tactical support to the enemy. As a result, our evac mission is in jeopardy. If our troops can successfully evacuate and regroup at North Point, right. they will become a formidable force in future battles. Your mission is to destroy the radar facilities on Mount Shesna, thereby blinding the enemy and hiding our troop movements. So even though I'm succeeding, we're still retreating. Got it. How much money do I have? Oh, I could buy an F5. Uh, what kind of weapons can I buy? What is your alternate? It's a spread bomb. And your alternate is a rocket launcher. I don't like either of those. Um... Why is your... Hold on. Why... If both of these have unguided bombs... Why is... Why is this rated for a lower air-to-ground? I don't understand that. I mean, I guess unless you want to say the defensive capabilities, but this is just faster, more maneuverable, and has the same weaponry. Oh, is there a return line in this? Oh, nice. Missed. We're just gonna go straight for the enemy. Or, straight for the targets. hit? No? Why do those not hit? This is why I don't- I'm not a huge fan of the unguided bombs. here and we're gonna take care of the radar and stuff over here Damn, 
I am kind of happy though because even with like the clouds and stuff like that, this does seem to be running normal speed. Compared to what it was doing before, which was running at like 70% speed. Mission update not accomplished. You gonna update me? Sky Eye here. Radar facilities confirmed destroyed. What do I need to do now? All aircraft take vector 180 south. Use the return line on the map to exit combat area and return to base. Okay. Fly in the right direction and you'll see a white dotted line across your flight path. Be nice if you gave me a compass on the screen. Oh, they're teaching me about the return line. That makes sense. Follow the controller's orders for landing. That does make sense. Mobius 1, perform landing check. You are cleared to land. Two miles to touchdown. How hard are they going to make landing in this one? One mile to touchdown. You're on the money. Slow down. Speed's too high. Slowing down means stalling. Although I guess landing it technically is a form of stalling. Nicely done, Mobius One. Go and prepare for your next sortie. With their radar out of commission, the enemy's command... So landing's not too difficult. We've discovered the erosions are transporting a large quantity of strategic supplies and rapid deployment troops into Converse Harbor. Converse appears to be the staging area for an attack on North Point. The Acre Fleet stationed here seems to be the centerpiece of this strike. If the Erusians complete their true preparations and the Aegir fleet sets sail, this will bring about our defeat in this war. Your mission is to intercept and shoot down the enemy transport planes in and around Converse Harbor. Let's show them how vulnerable they are. Okay. Be advised, the transport aircraft have ECMs on board that emit powerful jamming signals. Rely on visual contact rather than radar. Um.
Finch. Okay. Hi, Libby. Welcome in. How's it going? I apparently have to shoot down a whole bunch of transport planes that have jammers in them. Mobius one, Sky Eye here. You should be getting visual on the transport soon. Destroy the E seven sixty seven hidden. I'm gonna guess they're gonna be in the middle of the jamming fields. Good luck, Mobius one, engage. Engage. Oh no, they're not. Where? You're telling me that they're not in the middle of the jamming field? All right. Nice. And uh, apparently I don't have to worry about running into planes that I've shot down in this game. Think about design choices for your last Aerith. Okay. So I can. There must be another active electronic jammer. I can shoot down the jammers. It is. It is clear and functioning now. I'm gonna go shoot down the last transport plane. I can take him on. Fox two, Fox two. Nice kill. Good job, Mobius one. Destroyed. Good job. You shot down the enemy transport without any radar. Yes. That's how we do things. The mission was a success. This erosion air corridor has been affected. Lifeline. Okay. Congress Harbor. Home of the Acre Fleet is completely dependent on a single petrochemical complex for its fuel supply. The complex consists of a land-based oil refinery storage facility and an offshore oil drilling platform. So we're gonna blow it up. Your mission is to go out and destroy or at least damage these sites. Our objective is to reduce production out of this it. complex. Gonna go blow up the sites. The offshore drill uh, drilling and the storage. Can I buy something? Do I have enough? Answer is yes. Okay, what options does the F-16 have? Advanced air to ground. Um, I don't have enough of that. I would like that, though. Um... F-16 is much faster. F-16 is just an improvement on the other one, other two. Commence operation. Split into two groups and destroy targets. Inflict as much damage. 
damage as possible to the complex and reduce their output. Ah, uh, we're going this way. We'll be seeing a welcoming party any minute now. Refinery, Red Vector 310, 12 miles. Clear to engage. Bandit confirmed at Vector 310. Mobius 1, engage. Oh man, the sensitivity is so weird. Keep like hitting the wrong buttons. That's a huge chimney. Bombs away. Come on, baby. Daddy needs a bullseye. Nice power. Enemy facility destroyed. They stuck out of five million barrels. AA guns destroyed. What is pickle? And why do you, I mean, I know what a pickle is, but what does pickle mean? Is pickle supposed to be some type of maneuver? Fly in a straight line? What do you mean? Uh, I missed. Box two! Box two! Enemy facility destroyed. Hi, video see welcome in. Give them all you've got. Uh, apparently that sound alert is very quiet. Take out the fighters first. Right on the money. I might need to make that one louder. Break. That or the game is just that loud in my ears. Fox two, Fox two. Right. So sanitize my six o'clock. Box two. Box two. Enemy facility destroyed. Box two. You have the three month badge. And it's mine. Yes. Hard enemy radar spike. Is it because you got gifted a sub? Well, so the three month badge happens at the beginning of the third month. The way the sub badges work is they're the beginning of it. So I've been I've been streaming now for um, I think, hold on, let's see, it's the 25th now, I've been streaming for, th for three months. Alright, I 
need you to not You're in good dodge. Range. Radar lock. Mobius one, box two. Missile shot trashed. Thanks for the save. All right, we're gonna go for the easier targets. Time is flying by. It's been a whole ton of fun though. Can't lose them. I've got things planned for an announcement on my birthday. Fox two, Fox two. Because <clears throat> we're coming up on um, Sorry, the next big thing is gonna be six months. Pickle is. Why, why, why do they keep saying pickle? Why would pickle mean pull up, though? I'm sorry, Badusi. The other thing too is, die you sob. Why not just say son of a bitch? Anchor. Enemy vessel sunk. It's a bit cut off. Is it? Hold on. Uh, that's cut off on stream element side. Hold on. What part gets cut off? Can you go to my dashboard? Can can this work? Why is this Okay, I'm gonna have to fix this later, cause uh, I can't, cause I can't get into my stream lab, my stream elements dashboard right now, and I don't know why. It's just not loading. Attack! And I'm not gonna try to fix that on stream. I will try to fix that for next time. Obvious one, box two. Enemy facility destroyed. Oh no, I don't, I, I don't know. Box two. Appreciate you letting me know. Destroyed. 
Out of missiles. Oh, there is a return line. Um, it's not super early. It's one o'clock in the afternoon. But yeah, I'm good. I'm currently playing, um, some Ace Combat. Um, a lot of my Saturday streams, though, are... Uh, I've been starting at noon. And then I've been doing one or two streams. Today I'm not gonna be doing a second stream. Today it's just gonna be this one. Is that all I need to do? Picture is clear. Bandits are down or no factor. All aircraft RTB. Okay. <clears throat> the enemy lost 5 million barrels of reserves and the ability to process 250,000 barrels of crude oil daily. Okay. A freeway under construction in a wheat field outside of town. When they started construction, I remember how the mayor bragged about it, even though it would completely bypass our town. <clears throat> the freeway became the occupation force's makeshift runway, and the unfinished tunnels their bunkers. This was their base. How? Oh. They were the elite flight squadron. <clears throat> That's, uh, that's one way to take advantage of that. The same cannon that was created to shoot down the asteroids became a catalyst to the war. But when the Allied attacks no longer came, the squadron was assigned long-range missions that took them to distant battlefields. I thought of the words I would use to confront him and bided my time. Your kid. Although I harbored these feelings within me, I could never get close to him. His wingman was Welcome back. by his side. Despite having a gentle demeanor, Game's I going well. the wingman would never allow danger to get near Yellow 13, even on land. The pillar of their group, 13 exuded an air of invincibility. He always chose to fly a five-plane formation. He was a man who prided himself not on his okay. record. I just got chased off the battlefield by this guy. Record of never losing a squadron member. It's difficult for me to describe just how good Yellow 13's flying was, but I witnessed it once from the ground. The lead plane with the five-plane formation should have turned the same arc with the same timing as the others, yet only his plane drew sharp contrails. His heart felt compassion towards the weaker enemies he downed. Someday, if an equal appeared and challenged the limits of his skills in a fight, he would bear no resentment about being shot down. He said this himself. And so as time passed, I found the goodness of a home in their company. Leaving them was no longer an option for me now.
Uh, I believe it's called Stockholm Syndrome. That's not normal, kid. <clears throat> we will launch a surprise attack on the Aether fleet while it lies immobilized at Converth Harbor. This large-scale airstrike will be the largest and the most strategic operation since the transfer of HQ to North Point. You may need to resupply along the way because this operation will be long in duration. Okay. Remember, it is imperative that you complete the mission objective and return to base. What else can I buy? I can buy an A10. Or the MIR 2000. We're going to sell the F5. A10 has advanced air to ground and a cluster bomb. We're going to use the advanced air to ground in this mission. Over here, because there's a. Uh... Don't forget wingman consideration during combat. Mobius one, engage. Omega, repair, engage. Repair twelve, engage. Give them all you got. Aegis class Raven sunk. Go and get them. Many ships are stranded within the harbor. Don't fret, this ship won't sink. Oh yeah. Our invincible fleet's um This plane does not pick this plane does not actually turn very fast. Initiate attack. All aircraft clear to engage. Any we're not going to talk about that. Sink the invincible Asia fleet while they're at anchor. Good luck. We're not we're not going to talk about that. Mobius 1 engage. Every time you watch me play Ace Combat, you keep trying to remember which one you played as a kid. Uh, I mean, there's a whole bunch of them I've played at this point. Do you, do you remember, I mean, if you only played it briefly, you probably wouldn't remember, like, what the plot was or anything. I know one of the more popular ones was Ace Combat Zero. Thing you remember doing is shitty bombing runs. Speed away from the Beluga, sunk. 
Um... Was it this one? It must have been since you don't remember the HUD of three or graphics of five. Because this one did start off with uh, with bombing runs. for the high value targets first. Shoot him off me. Fox two. Alright, we'll take them off. Alright, have a good one, Bazusi. Thanks for stopping by. Bandit behind you. Attack all the facilities. Spike. Enemy facility destroyed. Heads up, enemy radar strike. Enemy destroyer sunk. Hi, Varnus. Welcome in. How's it going? We're doing well. We're doing well over here. Just playing some Ace Combat 4. I actually got this game to work at fairly normal speed. I, I haven't noticed it slowing down. Uh, oh, I only have regular missiles left. Enemy facility destroyed. Obvious one, box two. Submarine Beowulf new sunk. It's no good. Sam destroyed. You always stay in my stream to make fun of me if I deserve it. That's fair. Y'all do like to, uh, to bully me. Is it gonna hit? Ooh, it did. I need 3,000 points and then to survive for 9 minutes. Oh man. Enemy cruiser sunk. I was gonna say that one better have hit. Uh go over here. Beowulf pie? I want pie. Oh, 
Oh wow, I have to shoot these from like in front. So we have to come in from low. We have to come in low and from this angle because of the buildings that are around these subs. That one missed. I did not hit that. I was low, but I didn't hit that. <clears throat> Good to know hitboxes aren't completely accurate in this game. Converse Harbor, Infector 350, on the nose. Engage. Engage. Again, it's mine. Enemy destroyer sunk. Hard enemy radar spike. Cruiser Lazuli sunk. Hard enemy radar spike. Just say missile launched. Enemy cruiser sunk. Don't fly in a straight line. All right, now. Ooh. That was close. Oh, it's funny to me how this game does not make it so, um... The guns and stuff on the ship, when the ship gets destroyed, uh, also get destroyed. Alright, we're gonna go over here. We're gonna deal with these over here. The ones that are escaping. Just continue. Because now we got more missiles. The resupply ship is damaged. Target hit. Are we going to shoot? This is a nice surprise. Aegis class Raven sunk. I'm going down. Carrier Geophon sunk.
gonna shoot down that. I think all we have left is planes there, but just in case, I'm gonna resupply because it's right fucking here. There's amphibious craft too. The sunken ships are blockading the others. Oh, there's a chopper. Interesting. Aim for the fuel. Don't fret, the ship won't sink. Box two. Surface target destroyed. We'll head toward the back of the harbor. Surface target destroyed. Shipyard facilities with vector 030 four miles. Say your prayers. I see him. Enemy facility destroyed. Surface target destroyed. Destroyed. Wrecked. These two cranes right here. Y'all gave me an A-10 on an anti- on an anti-ground mission. I'm gonna abuse the shit out of this plane. Evacuate! All evil ships, attack! AA guns destroyed! Enemy facility destroyed! It's in the way, sink it! It's in the way, sink it! Isn't it already in the- isn't it already sunken? He's not actually on me, that's an old line. This dick was just like, hey, I'm gonna shoot you. Hard enemy radar 
Polaris bike. Fucking jackass. Got him. Yeah, we're gonna go over here. Looks like there's some high value targets over here. Out of missiles? Oh, fuck you. I'm gonna go refill. Ugh. Man, I'm gonna have to go get another soda. No worries, Umber. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome in. Hope you've got a good. Hope you have a good day. Oh wow, I cannot look backward. Every other Ace Combat game you can look backward. You can't in this one. Approaching point of return. Maintain current course to refuel. Mobius 1. Mobius 1, you are cleared for takeoff. Appreciate you stop by. Huh, oh, man, I need caffeine. Are you sure about that? It's not crash at this point. Dude still said like 75. Initiate. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Okay.
I'm going to be right back.
I have returned. Sink the invincible easier. Right. This time I have caffeine. We're going to start off with the closest targets. Um. Might as well re re uh, rearm while I'm here. Now's the chance. Give him all you got. Aim for the fuel. Sam destroyed. Destroyer to the front and left. The harbor facility. Uh, got that crane. Got that crane. Got that crane. Target destroyed. Bandit confirmed at Victor 020. Closing in on enemy. Enemy facility destroyed. Enemy destroyer sunk. Hit on the starboard side. It's in the way. Sink it. Slow speed reverse. Don't get sucked down with them. Destroyer Taish sunk. I'm gonna need to uh, resupply soon because uh, my health is fucking. My health is suffering. Damn it! Fucking. Hmm. Initiate attack. All aircraft clear to engage any and all targets. Sink the invincible Azure fleet while they're at anchor. Good luck. Right. Hmm.
Okay, we're gonna do this again. We're gonna do it right this time. We're not gonna get shot down towards the end, or we're not gonna crash with less than a minute to go. Okay, we got rid of that one. And maybe this one? Please have good angle? No. What about that? So this time we are going to go this way. Don't let them escape. Make them fish food. That's mine. Fox two, fox two. Their facilities were wiped out. Enemy destroyer sunk. Eject. I'm ejecting. Right, we're gonna hit this one on the way into the resupply. And then we're gonna turn around and come right back up and destroy all this shit. Mobius One. Mobius One, you are cleared for takeoff. That one's out. Uh, we're gonna go up here. So we got this single Sam. Sam. Have a good one, Varnus. So hope to see you around. Thank you, you're gonna do a bit of a stretch. Appreciate you stopping by and hanging out. Destroyed. Damn, 
Right. Okay, so then we're gonna go this way. Fox two, Fox two. Enemy cruiser sunk. Enemy facility destroyed. Take care of this missile. Take out that missile boat, and then we got uh, this fuel farm over here. Destroy those. Uh, we got a plane up here. I love dog fighting in an A10. deal with this one. Oh, they missed. Missed. Fox 2, Fox 2. You're in gun range. Locked on. No? Yes. Aha. Right into it. Can't dodge that if it's going to be right in your face. Resupply, rearm. Mobius one. Mobius one, you are cleared for takeoff. We're not going to crash into the ground. <clears throat> I 
Basically, at this point, all I gotta do is survive to the end of the mission. I've already hit the goal. Let's, uh, dodge this. Take care of this one missile, because this one missile is turning out to be a pain. How would you feel if you were flying like an F-14 and you got shot down by an A-10? One of the slowest moving planes in existence. Hi, DOA. You feel like you just got shot down by a farting plane? Like, just look how slow I'm turning. Locked on. Fox two, Fox two. Uh, as you can see, I though, I though I did get um an AC-130. Yeah, an AC-130 is even slower than the A-10. Sky Eye here. Enemy fleet and harbor facilities confirmed destroyed. Well, welcome in. Mission complete. All aircraft, RTB. Hopefully you're having a good day. I know we we had a late night last night. Nice to see me again. <clears throat> the erosion so-called invincible. All right. <clears throat> so. <laughs> Let's see. You're trying. Probably need to get some sleep after your next. Oh my god. Wait, you haven't been up since last night, have you? Your next mission is to Please tell me you've gotten some sleep. Generator plants in the Faith Park region. These generators equal nuclear ones in output and provide about 60% of the energy for the Illusion's military industrial complexes. Since they do not require oil or uranium supplies, 
We cannot stop power production by interdicting their supply lines. This deep strike mission will not only cripple the illusion's industrial output, but also divert attention from our own imminent invasion. You sleep during the day? So wait, you have been up since last night? Holy crap. Um. Okay. As long as staying up is normal for you. Okay. F A eighteen. F fourteen. Right. Watch me earn my way A swings today. Oh, you mean the thing that I've already kind of done? Don't be predictable in heading around the tube when they close in. Here we go. This is the real thing. It's always been the real thing. This is not new. Solar power generator plant in vector 350, 20 miles. Mobius 1, engage. Okay, I hit one of them. Right, so we're behind you. Gotta get behind you. Mobius one, box two. Right. There we are. Keep your guard up. End it at twelve o'clock. Sanitize my six o'clock Omega five. Halo seven, get him off me. Sorry, I can't. Mobius one, shot down a bandit. Okay. So these missiles are nice. Solar power generator plant at vector 350, 12 miles. Assuming they hit. Mobius 1, Fox 3. Lead them to me. Shoot him off me! Solar power generator plant at vector 350. Eight miles. Strip off. Locked on. Missed. Mobius one, box two. Those were not great. That should be... Unless you actually... Heads up. Unless you actually dodge them. Uh, there we go. Damn, incoming missile! Bandit at 12 o'clock. I've taken damage. Keep going straight. To get one of the two of them, at least. Oh, I got both. Solar power generator 
plant in vector 330, four miles. The glow up ahead is our target, the power plant. Jesus. Below 2,000 feet. What do they expect us to do? Go underground? Head toward the ravine and terrain mask. Use the crevices. Get low and stay low. What are you talking about? It's suicide to fly into that ravine. Four rounds. ETA in 15 seconds. Mobius 1, descend to lower altitude. Omega 3, get out of there. Okay. Another way from Stonehenge detected. Ten seconds to impact. Vapor 11 crashed. Five, four, three, two, one. Impact. Come in, Vapor 9. close. That's nuts. The mission succeeded, but the combat losses due to Stonehenge were higher than expected. Victory will elude us and- At some point I realized my uncle, my would-be guardian, had vanished. Maybe the secret police dragged him off for some drunken comment he made. Maybe he chose to disappear. I didn't have anyone to turn to. So I found myself living as if I were a member of the Yellow Squadron. Okay. Everybody in town scorned the barkeep for doing business with the enemy. 
in reality, he and his family were members of the resistance. Hi, Autumn. Gathering up intelligence information. Welcome from in. Enemy customers. So what I think so far? Um. His daughter protected me. Controls are wonky, but it's an older game. But that was only because... Story is interesting. Age. Um. Some of the animation's a little bit odd. We're the real heroes. Long like, there's literally a scene where a kid has their head on backwards. Among the enemy. It definitely feels like some of these are missions for the sake of missions. But that's to be expected for an older game. Like, there's no real plot in the missions themselves. At least so far. ...will be launched from the Kamora Islands rocket base to support our mainland operations. The Erusians responded by deploying a large number of their air superiority fighters to prevent the launch. A large-scale air battle is expected. We must win this battle to maintain... You don't even remember if the kid says backwards in the disc version? We've only got one window of opportunity for this launch. I know, uh, Mini... over the rocket base. Um... Mini clipped it. If you, uh, I think, I think they posted it in the Discord. So this one's completely air. Let me see. What do we have to buy? F eighteen. You've been working on stream? Oh, okay. Um. <coughs> I definitely see aspects in this in every other Ace Combat game. I mean, for the age of the game, it's not, uh, it's not that bad. Mainly listening to me as I, as you pack up your life. I mean, that's fair. Um, in terms of difficulty, the game's not super difficult because a lot of the AI is pretty basic so far. But I mean, that is to be expected with some of the older games. I mean, it's nothing like a was it Ace Combat Five where you know they give you the uh, the super plane. Attention, all personnel! Complete final last checks immediately. Why are you? Oh, you have. Oh. Oh, this fucker's got high G turns without the mechanic in the game. Okay. Okay, actual dogfighting? Ow. The difficulty that comes in your opinion with world effects is like Stonehenge and other things. And if it's one of the yellows, they're bullshit. Yeah. Um, I've hit you multiple times, and suddenly I can't hit you anymore. Is there a return? Oh, there is a return line in this. It seems like they... I don't know if this is the case, but it seems like so far almost every mission has had a return line. Come on. I'm 400. 
400 yards or feet away or whatever this shit is, and I can't hit this fucker with a missile. Okay. I have spent so many missiles chasing down this one fucker that I actually need to go resupply. I still haven't shot them down. We're gonna resupply. We're gonna rearm. We're not gonna change weapon. Welcome to the fighting yellows. Or fighting the yellows. That's fair. I have an easier time fighting Mr. X in Ace Combat 7. Granted, that's partially because of high G turns. However, Mr. X also does high G turns. I definitely like the, um... How many did the yellows get? I like the music better in, um, 0, 6, and 7. Box two. Box two. It is an old game. I will give it that. But not my favorite Ace Combat soundtrack. Your plane is yellow, but I don't think you are one of the yellows. Very samey soundtrack? Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised if they basically were like, uh, to whatever band or whatever that they got to do this, they were like, hey, we need some epic dogfighting music. And the band just kind of jammed out. Because it's kind of what it sounds like. Like, the music doesn't change. All right, why did you not get shot down? You're in gun range. He's on my tail. I'm in the break here. Locked on. Fox three, Fox three, Fox three. Radar lock. <laughs> um. Why are you slowing down? I don't want you to slow down. That's nice. Alright. So... That one miss. The other thing I've noticed is when you're really far away from planes, the game unfocuses them. Which... I guess would save a lot on, like, game resources. But in a fighting, like, a, 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 a plane game, like, some of the... No, 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 you're good, DOA. You don't need to apologize. But, uh... Need two bombers. Them before they reach the launch site. 
Negative contact, nothing on my radar. Look harder. V2s are difficult to detect on radar, they're still. Uh, this way's what? I, the other thing too, Mojo, is I'm not a huge fan of the fact that there's no compass on the screen. There's been times where they've called out, like, bearings and shit. Oh, I guess, I guess the compass is if you were to use this. But, like, I like the, I like this view. Like, that... That, that makes more sense, like this. Some odd choices. Oh my lord, why did you not... Why did the game not give me the missiles? It's so funny to me how little technology has changed. B2, shut down. How much and how little technology has changed over the last 20 some odd years. Like, fighter jets and shit like that, not all that different. The other ones in the series are definitely better, but Nostalgia playing this one with your dad. Yeah, that's fair. That's valid. Nostalgia is definitely a thing. Oh. Um. Outside of multiplayer. Was this this one wasn't co-op, was it? Or did you like you and your dad um, like trade off on missions and stuff? Yes, there are bandits behind me. I'm in a dogfight. It's bound to happen. You trade up. You would have said it about aircraft, among other things, but it bears... It bears repeating. If you give them the chance, people will optimize all the personality of something. Um... That's fair. Fox two, Fox two, you're in gun range. But uh, oh, you said it before, but okay. Locked on. You mean in terms of how? Because everything is so optimized that um, things haven't changed a whole ton. Like for instance, one of the perfect examples. One of the most dominant planes of today's, and I'm not talking like in in the game time today. I'm talking like like real life today, like modern. Like it's not really modern day because we're not really in the modern era, we're era anymore. Yeah, no, that's fine. Um, so one of the one of the most dominant planes right now in the military is the F-22. However, the F-22 was designed like something like 30, 40 years ago. So it's designed using the older technology and then they modernized the guns on it. That's about it. And 
And the thing is, everything costs so much to do, so much to design, so much to... to if it ain't broke, don't fix it. I mean, the F-22 is pretty broke. You're in gun range. Fox 2, Fox 2. Um, another plane that was designed a long time ago that is one of the most used aircraft now, the F-35. That one was also designed like something like 35, 40 years ago. Maybe not 35, 40 years ago. Maybe like... I might I might have my timeline screwed up on that one. That one might be like 20 years ago. If it costs 100 plus million dollars, don't fix it. Well, they had to. For certain planes, they had to. The F-35 was broken. They did have to fix that shit. They had to almost redesign that plane from the ground up. That's one of the, that's one of the reasons it's most, one of the most expensive planes nowadays. The A-10 came out in 77. So what, 30... No, almost 30, almost... Uh, A-10 is still used... Um, not in active deployments. It has been retired from active deployments, but it's still used for, like, air shows and stuff. The rocket launch proceeded smoothly, and all systems are go. It, almost 50 years. For providing our troops with I was trying to do the actual math. What is that, 30... no, 45? It won't be long now. It 45 years? Until it begins. The barkeep's daughter confided to me. But a couple of years ago, the A-10 was um, pulled off the front lines. The Allied counterattack on the mainland. What will happen to these people when the Allies come? I asked. To which she frowned. We'll run them out. This is our town. But I knew she didn't mean that from the bottom of her heart. Thirteen had captured her heart. I knew this from the way she shot jealous glances at his wingmen. As other pilots rotated out of Yellow Squadron, Yellow 4, 13's wingman, always stuck by his side, even on land. The only female pilot in the squadron, she had Yellow 13's absolute trust as his wingman. Yellow 13 seemed oblivious to all this, and instead reviewed the yeah. promising enemy pilot's performance. Have a good one, DOA. Thanks He's for so stopping close. by. Appreciate you hanging out. If he manages to stay alive for just a while longer, that pilot could be a worthy opponent. But when there were no such enemies to look forward to, 13's eyes... Are you sad. going to bed? Yeah, have a good sleep. The A-10 has kind of hit that stage where it's almost like the F-117. Where it's been retired and it's still used occasionally, but it's not used on the front lines to my knowledge. The troops Almost all the stuff that the A-10 was used for, now the F-35 does. Just like I believe, I'm not 100% sure, I believe the F-18 has also been pulled in favor of the F-35. I believe the F-16 is still being used, but they do favor the F-22. And the only reason why the F-16 is used because it's, it's a cheaper version of the F-22. Your mission is to reduce. I believe. I could be wrong. Uh, a lot of ground targets, some air. Do I have new planes to buy? Uh, F-15. Right, the F-15 is fast. So is the MiG. Wow, that's that is a fast plane. Except for starting its own engines. That's fair. What do you have for... Let's see, you got an unguided... You got an unguided rocket. Okay. Unguided bomb, small. Headquarters, this is Lieutenant Bales, Commander of... 
It is a durable plane. However, it's also very slow. And part of the reason why it was pulled off the front lines is uh, it's not hard to shoot at from the ground in terms of a person aiming at a plane in the sky. And a lot of modern day combats uh, deal less with actual tanks and more to do with actual people. Oh, is the game slowing down in this mission? You're right, it's not a it's not a plane, it's a flying tank. I am upside down. This rain is just destroying how fast this game can run. Um, I know the... Is it the B-17? I think it needs only a third of the total wingspan to fly. And they know that because, um... One came back with a third of the wingspan and it then still took off again. The other thing too to keep keep in mind when it comes to aircraft is a lot of the times things aren't outdated because of the design because of the it's more of um, the technology that's used on the inside of the plane to fly it. Updated electronics. It's also the same thing with um, with jets and stuff like that, and like um, passenger um, operations. Sam destroyed. This rain is just destroying how fast this game is running. Varnus. Varnus, welcome in, welcome in. How's it going? Varnus. Welcome in, Raiders. Welcome in, Raiders. You... Oh, thank you, Mini. Uh, you were playing Celeste. What is Celeste? Oh, I'm, I'm sorry that it refused to run. That sucks when a game, uh, when a game does not want to run. I know this one. I had a backup of Ace Combat 7 in case I didn't want to run at full speed. It's a rage game with an amazing story. It's a platformer? Okay. This rain effect is just destroying how fast... If I were to look at the percentage right now, I think it's probably running at 80%. 85%. Yeah, it's one of those games that made you cry? Oh no. Wait, Mini, isn't it not very hard to make you cry, though? Right, we're gonna drop that one there. Drop that one here. The game just refused to accept your controller as existing, but your controller's plugged in. So until you can figure out the cause of the controller glitch, 
You're big softy. I mean, there's nothing wrong with being a big softy. I was more just pointing out that... It, um... It does not take much. That, uh, that sucks, Varnus. I'm a pretty big softy, too. Uh, so we got five minutes remaining in the mission, but in reality, it's probably going to be closer to seven because of the game is running at 85% speed. Okay, sounds good. Wait, what was the no Zemo to? Oh, you jerk. I miss hygiene turns. Come on. Come on. Oh, it's going to be running closer to 70% 70, 70 of that point. Oh, you jerk. Come on. I cannot control this plane Check behind right now. There we go. I'm glad that you're now out of the stall, but apparently the AI don't have stall limits. You're just gonna feel it. We've got on the radar. Shots fired. I'm oh, I hit one. Heads up. Enemy radar spike. Evade. Come on. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Fucking. Are you serious? Are you serious right now? You take the one on the right. I swear to God. I swear to God. I'm gonna go over here and look for additional targets because I need to make up uh, 700, 800 points right now in two and a half minutes. So this could be kind of interesting. What the f- Okay. Game. You need to decide to run at full speed or not. Oh my lord. I know you're an old game. But I don't have a shit CPU on my computer. So you need to decide to run well 
or run poor. Please do not go down to like 60%. Uh, this is Unit T. We're on the beach. This is Unit Q. We're on the beach. Target hit. Hard enemy radar spike. AA guns destroyed. I swear to God. Um, okay, so, <clears throat> so, it, it has to do with the software encoding. Um, because of the way that the encoder ran on the older, on the older systems, it took into account very specific CPU timing. And so the issue is that the... Like, the newer CPUs can run faster, so they can accomplish more. So what it ends up doing is, is because it can process more, it, it puts more space between, um, between what's actually there. Oh my lord. Game. The other thing too is a lot of modern CPUs are based around having a having a GPU attached to it. And right now, it wouldn't be bad if I wasn't streaming. So I'm I'm putting additional load on my CPU right now. If I wasn't streaming, this would probably be running at 100 percent even with the rain. It's it's almost like it, it's almost like running this with an integrated graphics card. I'll put it that way. Um, and just the way that it just the way that it's encoded. Um, are you fucking kidding me? I ran out of time. Okay, we're gonna try something real quick. So here's what happens with hardware. So this is now using my graphics card. And the issue with this, you can kind of clearly see, is it's missing textures. And that's just the way that it's encoded. But it's running at normal speed now. Like, it runs smoother, it works, it works better, it doesn't have a stretch resolution. Um, but the trade-off is the textures and stuff like that don't work. Surface target destroyed. Our troops are bogged down. Surface target destroyed. In fact, actually, this might be running faster than 100%. Enemy facility destroyed. Um, Obvious one, box two, tank destroyed. Missed. It's an interesting thing, and I don't know why this game does not run in hardware, in hardware compatibility mode. Every other game does, but this one does not. And I think it has to do with the fact that the original PS2 did not come with a graphics card. It used just a CPU. So this worked at a this worked during a time where that that technology was not used.
but yeah, mini is. I mean, it's not completely. It's not completely. Uh, I'm doing a thousand things at once, and all of them are wrong. It's more of I. It's so. There's a technology that's used in modern day CPUs that weren't used all the that wasn't used all the time. It didn't exist back then, and that's multi-threading. So, when a computer has multiple cores, or when a, when a CPU has multiple cores, what it, what it really means is the same brick, the same piece of hardware, that can just do multiple things at once. And the reason why it's got this multiple, the multiple cores is so you can be like, so you can multitask. The original CPU that was in the PS2 probably didn't have that. It was probably a basic, like, oh yeah, this thing can think. Um, and because of that, the game timing and stuff like that were based around that. Which means that when you start doing, you know, multi-threading, it throws off the timing. I wish I knew more about it, because then I could I could better tinker with it and figure out like what makes it run better. Uh, but unfortunately, I don't, because then I'd probably be a programmer and I would probably have made my own system. Imagine being a programmer. Autumn, I am jealous of you. Hi Fred, welcome in. How's it going? Happy Saturday. Uh, pay no attention to the fact that my plane is currently missing textures. Um, I'm more trying to get through this mission than focus on how the plane works. Right, looks right now. I mean, ha your code might be a nightmare, but it's functional, and you're creative as hell. Um. So I am absolutely jealous of you, Autumn. I have no talent when it comes to that kind of stuff. If I'm being honest, my major skill in life is um, determination. I need to shoot down one plane. Ow. I swear to fucking god. I swear to god. Do not- Oh my god! Oh my god. Okay. Can you pause? Thank you. Give me two seconds. I'm going to be right back.
Ага. A new goal. What's 10,000? But yeah, Autumn. If you end up releasing your game, I would play it. I have returned. With more caffeine. You do not have air superiority over the beach. This isn't an office. This is uh, HQ. Friendly fighters are inbound. Continue efforts to secure the beach. We're gonna go this way. I'll circle it out. Clear to engage. And it confirmed. For whatever reason, you're not using your points. Omega one, engage. So I will say this about my current 10k redeem. Um our artillery fire into the enemy rear formations is ineffective. I might change it to something else that's similar because of all the stuff that's going on on twitch right now um there's almost a degree of like i don't want to get like i don't want anything to get uh flagged or anything so i might change it to like a different thing or like do something similar but like it's different a different uh phrase i'm not sure yet We're gonna go over here, we're gonna turn. And we're gonna go back and we're gonna do the other, we're gonna do another run across. Autumn, I would stream it too. What do you mean? Target <clears throat> Assuming I had permission, I would stream it. Surface target destroyed. Enemy tanks destroyed. AA guns destroyed. We're gonna get rid of that. Here we got one more target over here. No worries. Have fun with the fly things. Thank you, Autumn. Thanks for stopping by and hanging out. Appreciate you. And definitely let me know when you have any sort of release or when you're comfortable sharing things and i will i would love to would love to help you test things enemy vehicle destroyed Uh, 
Um, I don't know if those are one missiles or two to actually destroy. Uh, Alright, so we got the right side clear. And look at that, we're almost done with the points and we've got five minutes remaining. Don't have to fight any planes. Take out the Sam, and then we're gonna go back, and we're gonna go back over that beach. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Bandit confirmed at vector two one zero. Heads up, enemy radar spike. Enemy facility destroyed. Right, so now we're gonna go over there and drop one over there. And we're gonna see what's still we're gonna see what's still alive. Yeah, look at that, we have enough points. Fucking ow. Box two, box two. Flash one, flash one. Surface target destroyed. Meow. Picks bayonets. Fucking. Y'all use bayonets still? Enemy facility destroyed. Out of missiles. Out of fucking missiles. Oh my lord. Taking control of coastal positions and enemy artillery. I don't even know if I have time to resupply and get back. We're not gonna crash. I totally wasn't taking a sip of, uh, soda. You did a thing. Ooh. You did the arts. Hello, Corvus. Welcome in. Approaching point to return. Maintain current course to refuel. Mobius 1. Mobius 1, you are cleared for takeoff. You made a cat vis. I think I might I might see what 
might do one more mission after this before uh, looking about raiding someone. Uh, let's not crash this late in the mission with 20 seconds remaining. Tens are not this fast. Motherfucker, come back. Target hit. All right, hit one. You're in gun range. Target is neutralized. Mobius one, box two. Target down. That one's down. Oh, missed. Right, so that one should be... No? That one's down. Oh, we got one more. Gonna be over here. Right. <clears throat> Confirmed splash on all A tens. Unit B appears to have secured Crown Beach. Let's get off of this mission before switching back. The mission is a success. Unit B Commander, didn't you have some message for the pilots? This is Sergeant Collins. I've taken over command of Unit B. Tell them thanks for the supporting fire. Roger, this is headquarters. Mission complete. Established through fierce right. at each of the <clears throat> sites. But this is only the first. Let's see, it's 306. We're gonna do one more mission. <clears throat> Hopefully it's not too too bad. The Tango Line is a vital line of defense for the erosion forces on the eastern mainland. Istis Fortress is a strategic foothold on that line. It utilizes unique terrain features that make it virtually impregnable. Support our troops by attacking and neutralizing the combat power of Istis Fortress. Be forewarned, this will put you within range of Stonehenge. However, 
However, your skills should prove to be more than a man. Your skills. Your skills should be more than a match. Uh, it's a whole lot of, a whole lot of air and ground. What do we have for aircraft? What other weapons does the does this have? Spread bomb. That's right. Very carefully. Scion Air Base, hit vector 080, eight miles. Pull yourself together. Be precise boxmanship from all players. Enemy facility destroyed. Mobius One, engage. That map, the, the angle of that. Ooh. Thank you, Benny. Two seconds. Oh, what a way to pause it. Upside down. Man, they really don't like me, do they? I guess I kind of am in their base just destroying everything.
that did not hit. Mobius one, box two. That did. So, how? Here we are. Come on, come on, give me the angle. Attention, all aircraft incoming from Stonehenge confirmed. Thirty seconds to estimated impact. All aircraft to send below two thousand feet to terrain mask. Here they come. Dive for the deck. Have a direct hit from one of those and you're toast. Below two thousand feet. What do they expect us to do? Fly through the mountains? Yes. Cleared for takeoff. Head toward the combat area. Okay. They've got the advantage, so stay focused. Where is this thing? Is it up here? It is. Well, then fly and destroy things, and you won't have to worry about going home in a body bag. Halfway there. Whoa, we're halfway there. Beta confirmed at vector zero six zero. VTOL base at vector three six zero eight miles. Enemy Wait. facility destroyed. Wait. The fuck? Oh my lord. How am I supposed to shoot that shit? Fucking what? I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna see if there's some easy shit to pick up pick up off, over here. Ugh. Okay, so they have a flak somewhere. Sam destroyed. Obvious one, box two. AA guns destroyed.
Um, this is gonna be a bit of a pain. Enemy vessel sunk. Enemy facility destroyed. Found the flat gun. Or at least one of them. A -A artillery destroyed. Enemy facility destroyed. Box two. Enemy facility destroyed. All right, we're gonna come back around. These box two enemy vessel sunk. Enemy central base confirmed destroyed. to ask what these were, but it turns out that they're planes. I'm gonna go back over here, up here. Submarine dock. Very carefully. Oh, I switched. I didn't mean to fucking switch. All aircraft incoming from Stonehenge confirmed. 30 seconds to estimated impact. All aircraft descend below 2,000 feet to terrain mask. Hundred percent, fly through the mountains. Enemy facility destroyed. Ten seconds to impact. Eight, seven, six, five. All aircraft hit the deck and prepare for impact. Can't casually swim through the ground. No, planes don't do that very well. Their fortified facilities are located in and around the mountains. He's all mine. Movie is one. He's on your tail. He's all mine. Enemy facility destroyed. All right, now. Movie is one. Box two. Movie is one. He's on your tail. Enemy vessel sunk. There we are. Okay, we're gonna go back around. No, I don't see anything there. Sam destroyed. Enemy facility destroyed. Obvious 
Ow, what the fuck he just hit me? Use the dock to shelter the warships. He's coming in. Enemy facility destroyed. This one's, this is gonna be a pain because I have to do a very specific angle. here. this way because I've only got 19 misses left and quite a bit of damage so I'm gonna try to just kind of you're not ground targets I hate to say it but I'm not really gonna waste misses on you vector 150 12 miles Heal up and rearm. Approaching point of return. Maintain current course to refuel. Mobius One, perform landing. Mobius One, you are cleared for takeoff. And just like that, we got enough points. Gonna hit. Hi, Sign Apple. Welcome in. How's it going? <clears throat> you love this game? Um, I, uh, the last mission I had to run on hardware encoding 
Um, it's currently running on software encoding. Uh, and you'll you'll see here. I want to show you real quick what the difference is. So this is it running on hardware. So it runs smoother. It's running at a higher resolution. Um, but there's no textures. At least not for the planes. Oh shit. Um. Yeah, um... Um... Sky Eye here. We're inside Stonehenge's engagement zone. That didn't happen. Yeah, it has to do with the fact of, of how the game was originally coded. Um, because... It originally came up for the PS2, it was one of the early games for the PS2 where... Um... Um Resupply. It basically used the integrated graphics. Eight miles. So that causes issues for modern day um systems. I'll just put it out like that. I, I did a lot of, um, so unlike Ace Combat Zero and Ace Combat 5, um, this one didn't really work super easily, so I had to do a lot of tinkering with it, um, to get it to work better. And it wasn't really until today where I kind of had a bit of an aha. Uh, moment with it where I trigger I, I changed one one setting Enemy so it allowed it to have some functionality with my graphics card um which made the difference between it running at 80% and running at 100% um, but it still definitely puts a major load on my CPU comparatively. So that's why I'm using like the PNG um, instead of uh, the model today. I also don't have any extra programs or anything running. It's basically just this. Um, and that's just to help out with the load so it doesn't slow itself down. Which funny enough is if I run it in hardware encoding without the without the um, so it doesn't have those textures for the planes um, it actually can it actually doesn't really matter what I'm running in the background because it's actually using it on my uh, graphics card I will say this version, this this game, it's very unforgiving. Like the missiles hardly show up on radar. Mobius one, engage. Uh, and everything. Radar lock, box two. It's good to see at least the encoding is sophisticated. I mean, I don't know if it's necessarily sophisticated. Um. So much is just actually just basic. Like I'm totally running this program in like a jank version of it, but uh, I just want to play it because I, I have never played this one before. Uh, and after I beat this, I might rerun uh, Ace Combat Zero because now I have I figured out a better way to run that one with uh with hardware encoding where. Um, before I was actually running it with software encoding so I can make it run like crisper and cleaner and I think a lot of people actually missed that one when they did it you're used to hardware encoding only shaving, shelving off like 20 to 30 of workload yeah that's fair this one it's unfortunately because it's software encoding it's a hundred percent of workload is done by the CPU
or something like 90 percent but yeah I did not mean to switch to um, missiles, but that works. I was hoping to get that on the way up. Attention, all aircraft incoming from Stonehenge confirmed. Thirty seconds to estimated impact. All aircraft descend below two thousand feet. I also apologize if my flying causes motion sickness. This game is very sensitive when it comes to the uh, the flight stick. Please don't crash. Oh! This game is very unforgiving with uh, crashing into terrain. Radar was not accurate. Still okay. All right, all right, all right. Gunboat, con ah. container ship. Enemy facility. Watchtower. I could come back around. We're gonna get this high value target. I need to go from this angle. This is going to be the last mission that I do for today, though. I do have planes going on later. Okay, so now we can go. Over here. That one missed. I've only got 17 missiles left, so we are going to start heading this way. For the resupply line. I also only need 300 more points to beat the mission. You can't believe they've been in an airbase out here. Approaching point of return. Maintain current course to refuel. Uh. All right. 
taking off. Mobius one, you are cleared for takeoff. Why are you running slow? You were running at 100% fine. Mission complete. I just need to basically survive for 10 more minutes while racking up more points. We're gonna do this so it runs faster. I keep forgetting the controls to switch the camera. God damn it. Okay. We're going to continue this later. Because uh, I've crashed now like three or four times on that. Over halfway through that mission. We're going to come back to that. Because, uh, I don't want to get frustrated, and that one's a long mission. Who do we got to, uh... Let's see, let me, let me do this. Oop. Nope. Nope. Nope, we're not going to do that. Who do we got to raid? <laughs> oh, I did not mute myself on that. Let's, uh, let's see. Oh, that's right. Data is doing her, their, uh, their charity stream. Yeah, let's read data. Okay. And, um, do the standard 
think we're going to do the standard read message. Thank you, Minnie. Appreciate you coming by. Appreciate everybody for coming by and hanging out with me. Um, I will post next week's schedule as soon as I have it planned. Uh, but there's going to be a few fun things planned. Um, along with a um, with a couple potential collabs later in the week next week. But uh, I believe next time I'm going to be live is going to be Tuesday. I don't know what time yet. But I'll, I'll post it sometime uh, tomorrow. I try to get my schedule out on Sundays. But I um, hope to see you guys next week. And I hope you guys all have a good weekend. So have a good one. Bye.